at least in television, um, broadcast engineers, which is what I quote unquote am, they really are just the people that work with all the uh, technical side of the equipment. Um, you don't have to have an engineering degree. I don't actually have an engineering degree. Um, I became an engineer sort of by default because that's what they ended up always calling me. And I don't know how that really, that nomenclature really came into place. This was already true a good 30, 35 years ago when I first started in the field. And they would just call, it was mostly old military guys who had learned um, AV stuff in the Navy or in the military that I was working with. And they called themselves engineers. And I don't know really why that started. But um, that's it stayed to this day. And so like you have the audio engineer, even though really they're an operations person handling the mixing. Um, you know, they use the term engineer, I think, loosely in the television industry. And so um, because it, you don't have to have an engineering degree per se. But you do do system design. I mean, there, there are certainly the same elements that you would do in an engineering degree. It's just in this field, they didn't have degrees that you could get. You learn it on the job. What you learned is about electronics and about electrical systems, and then you apply it to this small sphere of video and audio, and then kind of get deep in that one area of it. 